hello everybody welcome to my video so today i'm going to do a diy black seed oil so one of my subscribers she asked me to diy a black seed oil so i also went you know to do my research to see the main um property benefit of this uh seed so guys really i saw this seed can do a lot a lot a lot of miracle uh, for our body so first and four i'm going to do the oil so i will also uh be talking how and what this oil really really does uh meaning as the benefit it has and what it can do for your health this uh seed is a miracle a miraculous seed so first let me just show you how it looks like so this is how it looks it's a little bit it's very very tiny like sesame seed you can't even uh, notice it's a seed but meanwhile it's a seed it looks like just a breaking charcoal but it's a seed when you break it you are going to find some whitish uh, uh let me see something inside so first i'm going to pour it into my blender to just blend it to become a powder meanwhile i will be doing two ways but today i'll be doing uh the one that you will be drinking for your head so why the second one i'll be doing it tomorrow i'll post the video tomorrow stay tuned guys i'll post the video tomorrow for how you can use it to grow your hair um your edge so i'm because i've started using it i've begin to see how it calm my inflammation because it's also anti-inflammation so now guys i blend everything so because i'm not going to use everything for uh, that's the oil uh to drink i'm going to just separate it so this is the blended one i'm going to add uh the ones i'll be needing uh for drinking you know to take inside that my um, a little blender mixer so the remaining one we pour it into this jar because from there each time i want to use for anything you can even eat it like that and drink one cup of water so now i'm going to the one i put inside this blender to mix now to do my cold press form so i'm going to pour my olive oil i wanted to use grape seed but i don't have it so i'm using olive oil now uh you can you are going to put the oil to cover you know the own uh blended uh seed so it's not going to, I, don't, I didn't measure it anyway so now i'm going to what i um i will explain here now is that i will blend for five good minutes then i will stir and leave it to sit for 30 minutes so each uh, every 30 minutes i will come back i will stir I will blend again for five minutes i will uh leave it to sit for so i did this for one hour 30 minutes so now i've come to the end because i'll be doing it as i said every 30 minutes i will blend i will let it to sit every 30 minutes i will come back so i did it th three times meaning one hour 30 minutes so now i've come to the final uh blending so guys you are going to uh just find a great a great a great a great result from this um form which i did it so now i'm going to just see fit by you know turning because this is the the the, the filter i'm having right now the other one i use it uh, for something else so i'm just going to press you no know, turn the what in uh, the oil sorry so after uh, turning everything to come out for the first time to separate it from uh, the blended seed so i'm going to use my other tiny um uh, let me say that that's the one i used to uh, make green tea so i'm just going to use the, because that one is very very tiny okay so that one will be able to at least to help me to filter the old seed from the oil uh, very well so now this is how i'm going to make the second uh filtering in this case i will have a fine and uh, separated oil uh from the blended seed very well so now guys let's talk about what it does to our health this oil can cure 
asthma, high blood pressure, diabetes, inflammation, cough, headache, eczema, fever, dizziness, and flu. It can it may also improve blood pressure, blood lipid, and even fight cancer. This oil can also reduce high cholesterol if you have high cholesterol or any kind of symptom in your body when you take one spoon a day make sure you you shake it if you have it in you are going to let it to sit in a dark bottle so guys i hope you love this uh diy so if you do give a thumbs up share with your friends and family to know how to diy code press at home bye bye